already know that. But if you don't already know that, that's okay. That means you're new here, and that is awesome. We like we like having new members of the Alana fam come and join us. And today we are here, South Lords Unite at the Alana Cosmetics ATC branch. This is the branch, and these are the pieces. Come follow me. And obviously, I've had coffee, so I'm just like, yes. So we're, <laughs> so I'm really excited to be here today with Miss Dorothy and Miss Grace as we talk about how to get glowing skin in five minutes. So I know here at ATC there are a lot of offices in the area, a lot of hospitals, a lot of places that have work. And maybe if you're one of those people inside those offices who needs to be perked up in between lunch break, for example, kakatapos mo na mahabang meeting, tapos mo ka ng I'm like, ah, oh, haggard ako kasi nakatapos ko na ng meeting. I need to be glowing again. You can come over to the Lala Cosmetics booth and we can give you glowing skin in five minutes. But yes. <laughs> but yes. So of course, this is not only, um, this is not only available at our ATC branch, it's available in all our branches. But in case you didn't know we had an ATC branch, here you go. You can see. Okay. So, before we get started, just a couple of reminders. First things first, um, Make sure to share this live while it is running. This is particularly for Facebook people. I'm sorry, Instagram, we're still working on this. Make sure to share this live while it's running and leave comments for a chance. One winner will get a chance to win some awesome, awesome stuff from Elana. Why do I do this? I don't know. It's fine. Yo. And also, if you guys have any questions, concerns, or things you want to talk about, make sure to comment them and we will try to answer as this is running and as these lovely ladies make me look like a human being and not a sick dead person, which is what I actually am. <laughs> so if you guys want to find out how to get going in five minutes, keep watching. This is going to be quick, fun, and we're going to answer all your questions before I'm all. As many questions as we can get to, let's get started. I'm going to take you behind the booth. Don't actually do this when you're getting a makeover. I feel like people in the mall are like, what is this weird person? I'm it. So I'm going to go Hello, Miss Grace. Hello, Miss Grace. Miss Grace. What are we gonna do for me today? Right here beside. Okay, so as mentioned, there are several services you guys can get at the booth. And I think um, for the past two weeks, we've been featuring different services. Today, we're gonna do a special service. Um, we're combining a few services together. We're getting a primer massage, and then I think you found touch up. Yes, five minute touch. Five minute touch up with glowing skin. Are we ready? Okay, so first we start with a primer massage. I am ready. I'm 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 ready. i am yeah, it also has Chewbacca oil, not Chewbacca oil, hi, my. <laughs> my just, my, my taste, you know. Um, Chewbacca oil is also known as Camellia seed oil, which is also known as green tea seed oil because the Camellia plant is what produces green tea. Yeah, so it's an antioxidant and a light moisturizer. I'm going to have be quiet now. Are there any questions, guys, so far? Yes, Question! Yes. Sorry. Bakit wala na po stock smile cream to powder foundi? Kasi binibigyan niyo lahat, but don't worry, we are restocking. <laughs> we are restocking. Okay, so I'm being massage. But but pag ganun yung ginagawa mo, at bila na ng pataas para hindi mag-sagit. <laughs> okay. Any more questions? While I'm getting a massage. <laughs> Malaki yung noo ko, as you can see. So, kailangan talaga um effort si ate. Oh, we have a question from Instagram. Yes, it's the germs. How are Louis you? Louis Bermuda says, malamig po ba yan? This is not cooling. This is just um, hydrating to the skin. Uh, if you want cooling, we do have a new product. It's the matte cooling powder that has cooling. Yeah. But this is just like, it feels wet in a nice way. Like, hydrating. Like, water na light lang. Yeah. And you, you have to do like this daw, di ba? Tama ko. Choose me with like ASMR on my face, like this. Yeah. And this is to stimulate the blood, I think, right? Yes. 
I feel like a very attractive spider is growing on me. Okay, so that's the effect of the DDCC primer. As you noticed from Kanina, my skin is actually more bright looking. That's really part of the DDCC primer's powers because it has color correcting peach tint. So if your skin is dull and sad, like mine is sad because I'm okay, so I'm sad ako kagabi. So yon. Um, if your skin is dull and sad, this is a really great thing to put so that it gets freshened up. And yun na kakasabi ko lang. If you are working and nagdaan kayo na sobrang sobrang habang morning meeting, wala ko pinagugutan. Question. Yeah, you can come here and get the makeover. Yes. Sticky po ba siya sa face? No. No, it, it dries down to kind of like a powdery cream finish. So it doesn't feel sticky at all. Like, wala. It just feels like nothing. Another question. Yeah. Meron po moisturizer. Yes, this has moisturizing benefits. The DDCC primer has moisturizing benefits. Just why? I request ko na siya yung gamitin sa akin kasi dry yung skin ko ngayon. Kasi sa ilong, sa kagami ko lang sa sakin. Another what? question. Is yes. it safe for lactating? Yes! 110%. We are safe. Well, I don't think it will be on 100%. But yeah, we are 100% safe for lactating moms, pregnant moms, etc. Because we have no hormone disruptors and endocrine disruptors in our products. I'm going to ask you about one of my influencers this morning. So, I'm going to ask you about What's next, Bobby? This is Lucinda's foundation. You can see this all this is here. I have spots on my chin, in case nobody knows. I have big bar on chin. I don't know why. I got it on my back. And I have eye bags on my slide. Question. Yes. Does it have shimmer? I think DDCC or... DDCC, no. Yeah. No shimmer. But if you wanted to have shimmer, you can add multi-purpose color cream in Dream and mix it there and it will make it shimmer. So right now, you're just tapping the concealer under my eye bag. On my eye bag. Question. Yes. From Is Young Basa. Yes. What shade are you using? I am using Cheer. Cheer is the uh, kind of catch all shade for all. Medyo mabukunde, di ba? Because and it's not an exact match for all mabukunde because it's concealer. Hindi mo kailangan exact yung match ng concealer, di ba? Yeah. Question. Oh, sorry. <laughs> is that compatible with oily skin? Yes. Very good. I don't know what happened. Ignore it. Don't worry. It is very good for oily skin. Actually, um, yung big thing is yung loose mineral foundation, loose mineral concealer foundation, really is best for oily skin. Sana ka absorb po siya ng oil, ni kaolin clay po siya. It is it is effect. It uh, it detoxifies your skin and it also pulls oil and kind of um, kind of keeps it at bay. It controls oil. Yes. Uh, another question from Instagram. Some yes. concealers oxidize. Does this? No. Nope. Lana does not oxidize simply because we don't have bind particularly for the loose. For the loose uh, variants, they don't oxidize because they don't have any binders in the product. Um, actually, if your foundation is oxidizing, if your concealer is oxidizing, the reason for this usually is that um, it is not able to handle the amount of oil production that your skin is doing. So you have to look for something that's more for oily skin. Or um, something in the product is reacting with your skin's natural chemistry. Uh, it is not true that just because you are acidic, all foundations will oxidize on you because all skin is acidic. Everybody's skin is acidic. And if you are not acidic, then you are probably this box. This is your face. Because all skin, literally all skin is acidic. All skin wants to have um, acid uh, because it is what protects your skin from dehydration. Question. Foundation and with SPF 60. What shade uh, is this? Chai Tea. Yes. So I'm actually Cafe Brevet, but I'm using Chai Tea lang right now because I'm tao ng slide. Question. Yes. Two questions. Why you started at the chin? Curious lang. And is it lightweighted kind of foundation? This is lightweight but full coverage. And the reason why um, the concealing started in my chin is because that was concealer earlier. And uh, Miss Grace was just putting on concealer in the areas of my face where I have blemishes. So a lot of my blemishes are concentrated in the chin area and under my eyes. Uh, and now she's just applying a light layer of foundation. Super, super light lang. Like, para halos wala. Because um, I've already concealed all my blemishes. I don't really need to have uh, heavier coverage. And it feels like nothing. Like I don't feel like I have anything on my face, which is very, very strange because I am not applying the makeup and it's like, oh, what's happening? And it's like, oh, nothing's happening. Like if you look in the mirror, oh, something's happening. My skin is perfecting. So this is the side that's that's full foundation. This is the side na wala pang foundation na kinonsil lang yung under eye ko. And you can see that I think this one is a little bit. I will see my glasses so I can describe to you what's happening. Wait, that's the wrong way to hold my glasses. Um. You can see that here you can see more redness, right? You can see more redness here because I didn't conceal this. And here it's like it's more even. 
Right? You can see the difference. Okay, question. Yes. Hindi po ba drying kapag loose mineral ang gamit? I have dry skin. If you have dry skin, do not use a loose mineral foundation by itself. It is really designed for oily skin. We're going to be very honest with you. If you're going to use it, um, best to mix it you can with your favorite emollient moisturizer. So you need to have something that's more like lotion, thicker, because your skin needs an extra boost of hydration. Um, we do not yet have a foundation that's specifically for dry skin, but we will! <laughs> Question! <laughs> Question. Yes. Question. Yeah. Sponge or brush or hand? Which Sponge. is better with brush, brush, concealer? Brush. I really feel like it's better to do it with a brush because um, you're using a you're using a loose powder. Um, and so I feel with powder, it's a little bit better to use a brush. You can use a sponge. I've seen some people do it, but they really they kind of end up shifting back to brushes because it's just more versatile with, with the format of the product that we're using. Yes. Kung naman ihahabol ko lang for Rowey Bermudez. Lola. Ako naman, I use loose mineral foundation, but I use the flower power spray to sort of balance it out. Yeah. Because I don't like it looking dry either. It's, it's super, like, I'm not gonna lie, this is super matte, and it's really meant for somebody who has, has oily skin. I have combination skin, meaning I do get oily, but I have, because I'm sick, so like, you know when you blow your nose a lot and it gets dry here? That's the only reason why I have dry skin right now, okay? Because I've been blowing my nose. But otherwise, like, I really have, like, oily combination skin. Has some dry spots, has some oily spots, and so this really helps kind of like keep my oily spots from not being too wet. Yeah. Did that make any sense? Let me yep. know, guys, if I'm making any sense. Question. I also have no glasses, so if I'm like doing this, I can't see. Damning question. Go! Oh, oh. Can the loose mineral foundation be a concealer, but do you need a lighter shade? The loose mineral foundation does have full coverage, so it does cover up a lot of blemishes. If you have scars or like darker pigmentation, I recommend you getting the loose mineral concealer foundation because it's designed with color correction. Uh, I never suggest you get a lighter shade of foundation unless you are using it as a matte highlight, which you can do. Like I, I did a, a live on that before, where you can use a lighter shade under your eyes to create like highlight. But otherwise, please don't buy a lighter shade of foundation. Uh, just say no to Esposol things. Love your skin color. Yes! Lip drop blush. Okay. For your blush and for your lips. So we're not gonna put a setting spray first. Pwedeng diretso yung, pwedeng diretso yung lip drop blush sa skin kahit palang layer. Hindi naman nagagalaw yung powder. Yes. Hindi na Wow. So I think, I know that's a question you guys have all the time, so now you have an answer. Let's go! Oh, we're using the pink one. I'm scared. What color? Go lang! Any color, it's up to you. I am scared, but I've never, I use, actually, I'm not scared, I've used this before. It's very important when you're, when our lovely beauty consultant is giving you a makeover to smile. Because it helps her find out where your cheeks are. So when question. applying a blush, you put it where your, your cheek goes up when you smile. Yes, question. How to make your blush last longer? How to make your blush last longer for manger. Setting spray. Setting spray, what setting spray would you recommend? For oily skin, what do you use? In stay mode. Stay. I stay for this, sorry. <laughs> for dry skin. I don't know. Why do I keep doing this? I don't know. A question. Go. Ano yung favorite mo na blush on? My favorite blush on is the multi-purpose color cream, which is out of stock. Because you eat it, you people eat it. Uh, favorite one is the multi-purpose color cream in Paradise or in Hope. I am one of the rare people who is more MCC than LDB just because I'm a hipster like that. But most people like the LDB one just because it's a bigger pan and it's more easy to control. I also like the MCCs because you can use it on your eyes. The lip drop blush is not. Yes, you do not use the lip drop blush on your eyes, right? Because it is not eye safe. And Elana is very transparent. We, we are full, we are opaque in foundation. We are transparent in our principles. So we don't lie. And we tell you up front, this is not meant for your eyeballs. So what next? Do I look like I'm not sick anymore? <laughs> okay. GG. And you're putting it on top of the blush. Oh. Ooh. And you're using an eyeshadow. So 
So can you show the camera what you're using? Because people don't. A lot of people ask me like how you use these multi-purpose color, uh, multi-purpose loose pigments, and they really are great as highlighters and eyeshadows. Um, especially if you want to add extra dimension to your face, a little bit more glow. Which is what today is about, glowing skin. In less than five, I think it's only been like, other than me talking all the time, it would have only been five minutes. Okay, the other side of my face, I should sit up straight. Kung nanonood na, should be like, why are you slouching? You sit up straight! Okay, fine. Parang hindi rin kailangan si, si Miss Grace today. Um, Miss Grace, what is your favorite um, multi-purpose loose pigment? Sensational. Why is it your favorite? Uh, you stay at night. What is your personal favorite Elana product? SKRC. Question. Yes. Ano po dapat yung setting spray for combination skin? Combination skin? Ano na flower power? Yes. Flower power. Question. Okay. Perfect. So now we will put on what? Lip balm. Ah, where is the beauty balm? We have some beauty balm. Yes. Cream blush versus tint. I think which one? Ah, which one? Like the lip drunk blush versus the lip and cheek creamy gel. It really depends on the finish that you want. With the lip drunk blush, you can get more of that um, kind of. It almost looks like a powder blush if you want a kind of more lighter, more controllable hue. Whereas if you want the watercolor blush effect, where it's kind of like coming and bleeding out of your skin, uh, lip and cheek gel. Take note of the lip and cheek gel. You, you have to put a setting spray before you apply the blush. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Please bow. In which way, Yes. No. It's balm. This has cool effect. This is not the way you want me to put it. Tao, what are you doing? Or are you doing it? Just like, what are you doing in your face? Please don't make it hard for the BC to do your makeover. Unlike me, I'm really good. Like, what are you doing? Uh, I have a question, pero yan. Can oh. you speak na? Okay. Yeah, I can speak now. Uh, what's the, the best lipstick. product perfect for contour? For contour, if, if they want to contour, yung pinapagamit is what? Light rose. Light, we have, ah, no, wala na Um, ah, ah, I remember. It, you can use um, Glee or Delight, multi-purpose color cream. Um, and you can also use a darker shade of foundation, two shades darker than your skin tone. Or you can, and it's something I actually do, use the um, eyebrow gel. Like you just like rub it into your hand and then apply it. Like yes, but I don't need contour today because I don't. Question, Olet. Yes, okay. Is it possible to use two shades of cream to powder foundation? I would. The cream to powder is a concealer foundation, so it's really more meant as a concealer than it is a foundation, in my opinion. It's really, it performs best as a concealer and you apply your foundation on top. Um, you can use it as a foundation, but again, it's only four shades because it's made for color correction. It's not made to like match your entire face. Um, for me, I would not use two. Well, you can. the only two I can see you using together is use Revive and something because Revive is really best for under eye. And the rest you can use as like normal skin. I hope I answered your question. Question. What, yes. Ano po yung brown shade ng lip and looks? What is the brown shade of lip and Love is fine. Today we're not applying lip and locks because Frankie does not like matte. <laughs> not gonna lie, I have, I have a, I personally prefer non-matte, and I'm okay with reapplying. Oh, this is the one that color green. Okay. This is my favorite product. You can use it on your lips, your cheeks, and eyes. And I have a question for when you're done with the lips. I can talk. Okay. Can we also have a free primer massage at any branch? Yes. It looks so relaxing. Yes, you can. Related okay. din sa ano? Yeah. May question din ako related sa primer. Uh -huh. Need po ba lagi mag primer when putting makeup? Miss Grace, what do you think? Kung gusto mo talaga mag last, you can use primer for uh, every day. Say for every day. Yeah, for me it's really about how long do you want this to stay on your face? 
Um, also, in the case of DDCC primer, I would recommend you use it every day because you need to have SPF every day. Yeah. Okay, so now we have, we're down to, I think, our last two steps. How about for the person and who eyebrows. asks if wedding mug um, a massage at any yes. kiosk? Yes. Uh, you can get the massage done at any kiosk. You can get a uh, makeover done at any kiosk. It's all free. Yes. I'll just take note and somebody asked me this like can I go to the booth and have them do my Halloween makeover because like, some people have like late Halloween parties I'm like no we do natural looking makeup so if you want someone to turn you into Maleficent no <laughs> we can't do that please so we're doing eyebrows now and this is a tip for you guys if you want someone to do your kilay find the Lana beauty consultant because they are experts at kilay like, I know I did a tutorial, like, I think last week about Kila, and everyone was like, what are you doing? And I'm like, I don't know, I'm not good at this. So here, watch someone who's actually good at it. Let's go. Okay, let's go. I have a question. Yes. Beauty balm or the lip scrub? Beauty balm. If you're asking me what I like, but lip scrub is more for exfoliation. Lip scrub is really if you're going to wear a lot of matte lipsticks. Because um, you, you're matte in general. Like, matte as a, as a product type. Like, it's really embedded in the idea of matte lipstick. Um, that they are going to be a little bit more drying than a, hydro, like a satin or a balm finish. So for me, use lip scrub if you're going to use a lot of matte lipsticks. Um, or if you just want your lips to be nice, stay exfoliated. And then use balm for like every day. Uh, our balms are petroleum free also, which makes them safe for daily use. Because petroleum, balms with petroleum, they tend to, they, can, they temporarily hydrate because Petroleum is a hydrophobic product uh, uh, ingredient, meaning it doesn't like water. Water can't penetrate your lips um, from the air, and so your lips become more dehydrated over time. Question? Yes. I know your glass skin glow. Is it a setting spray then, or it just add shimmer to your face? Glass skin glow is a skincare product and also a facial mist um, and makeup product. So what it does is it um, once the facial mist it hydrates your skin, it has cooling properties, and of course it adds a shimmer. But more than that, if you use it, the longer you use it, it actually does change the texture of your skin. The ingredient in glass skin glow that's active is something called Mandarin Clear. It's by Ichimaru Fargo's Japan. You can Google that. Um, and 1% of Mandarin Clear is enough to um, alter the texture of your top layer of skin, making it smoother and more reflective, giving you a glass-like appearance. Glass Skin Glow has 2%, so we have more than, you know, the minimum. Um, and so it's really designed to, perm to, over time, give you a makeover and make your skin healthy and beautiful. Another question. Yes. How to be pretty like you, po, Miss Frankie? <laughs> Love yourself. I'm, I'm gonna be honest. I, I, I'm gonna like let's let's get a little bit um, honest and kind of like transparent here. Growing up, I was called ugly. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Like you can ask. You can't ask my high school classmates because they will deny everything. But like in in high school, like in grade school, high school, I was called ugly. Um, I was called fat. Um, I was called not charming. I was called a lot of things. Like people, people up front told me you're not good looking. You know. Um, and I think the more I believed in them, the not good, the more not good looking I got. Um, <laughs> because when you internalize something about yourself, it does kind of come out in your face. And so at some point in my life, I kind of said, Am I gonna keep listening to this? And I'm gonna gonna let it keep affecting me? Or am I going to do the hard work? And it really is hard work of trying to love myself because I mean I don't have money for plastic surgery man I can't really change how I look so you know and so I decided quite late in life actually around my teenage years to start trying to learn to love myself and it's, I'm not gonna say that I do every day I am very insecure as a person but people have told me like hey you look like you're more blooming you look like you've glowed up and I really attribute that to the fact because I, my face has really actually changed much I mean I've gotten older fast so I look older pa, but I really attribute the positive change to just the fact that I decided, you know what, I don't care what the world's gonna tell me, I'm gonna like myself, and when that kind of comes out, people, it's contagious, people catch on onto it also. I hope that kind of answers your question about how to be pretty. It, there's no such thing as being pretty like a person, because everybody, um, there are only seven people in the world with your face, this is statistically proven, so only seven people in the world, well six people, look like you. So you're pretty much generally generally unique. 
um, and so it's you're not gonna be pretty like a certain person. The only pretty you can be is like yourself, and the only way you can do that is to learn to like yourself and know what suits you and know what makes you happy. Does that make any sense? This is a Miss Universe question. <laughs> Dang, damn it! I'm Wait. not Miss Universe. Somebody from Instagram yes. said branch in Davao, please. We have a branch in Davao. Somewhere. It's in it's in alanacosmetics.com slash pages slash store dash locator. Another question. Yes. Pwede rin ba yung pang kilay as eyeliner? Yes, it is safe as eyeliner, right? And pwede rin siyang eyeshadow. Dark brown. Yeah, the dark brown is really good as an eyeliner. The rest of the shades are really good as eyeshadow. If you want eyeshadow that does not come off your face. Because it will not come off your face. I'm just gonna warn you right now. That you're gonna have to take it off with a makeup remover. We have a makeup remover. <laughs> yes. Question. Yes. Pomade or pencil? Pomade. Because it makes, I have like, if you notice yung hair ko dito, it sticks up. So may like, alam mo yung, yung Tagalog? The English word is cowlick, okay? And it's a word in Tagalog, it just means that your hair sticks up and it should go down. So my hair does that on my eyebrows, and the pomade makes it stick down. Also, the pomade that we have has um, marula. marula oil, which helps with the health of hair. That being said, I would still use a pencil if you guys are, you know, just want to do a light sketch. If you want more like natural, not completely kilay, it's like brows. Um, as to when we'll have a pencil, I don't know, but I am praying always. Question. Yes. Waterproof po? Yeah, the eyebrows are waterproof. The foundation is waterproof, the eyebrows are waterproof. The primers are generally waterproof, yeah? The lips, the, the, the lip stuff is not. Like, this is this is gonna come off. This is not transfer proof. Well, this is gonna stay for a long time, but on my mouth, not so much because I talk too much. And also because it's not matte, so it doesn't stick to your skin, and so it does come off. But that's okay because I like reapplying and it makes a stain in Another one from Instagram. Are you going to release a brow mascara? I don't know. <laughs> Ask the rest. <laughs> we pray every day. Someone says, fast talk with Frankie, you guys. With a hand. Yeah, every day is fast talk with Frankie because I have a problem with talking slowly. I've been trying, guys. I've really been. Okay, we're going to have a new segment. What's that? Fast talk with ano Frankie. To? Vanilla or chocolate? It's that level. Um, uh, lights on or lights off when you're makeup on? Because you can see the makeup when you're makeup on. Another one from Instagram. Do you have to remove the hair yung brow pomade? No, it actually has maroon oil which improves the health of hair. I'm not... I, I, my, my, so people are telling me that it might be psychosomatic because they, they don't know this, but I've noticed that my hair has been growing back thicker since I started using the pomade. Like, I've just noticed this. Um, so, my brows from before versus now are just more thick. I don't think it made more hair, I think it just made my hair thicker. I don't know if that's because of the marula oil, but I've heard it can do that, so, you know. That, that, that's my um, non-brand, that's just my personal opinion as to what happened to my own face. Okay? Question. But, yeah. Which pomade shade has a cool un undertone? So our pomades are made to match the hair versus like undertones. Um, so it's more of like what color is your hair? So if you have blonde hair, bleached hair, you know, purple hair, I had purple hair before, um, you use uh, light brown. If you have reddish colored hair, more warm undertoned hair, you use red brown. And if you have dark hair, uh, you can use dark brown. Question. Pwede ba ang glass skin glow on oily skin or kailangan ba ng ibang setting spray before using glass skin glow? Uh, Miss Grace, what do you think? For oily skin, it's better when this is you can matte it by inner skin. Yeah. And then I think you can put glass skin glow on top if you if you want. But wait for the stay, matte, uh, stay fresh to dry. Another thing you can do if you have oily skin is you can, instead of using stay fresh setting spray, you can use stay matte poreless powder um, to mattify your skin and then put glass skin glow on top. Yeah. Question. Yes. What's the makeup product you can't live without? What's the makeup? DDCC primer. Right, Miss Grace? Yeah, I can't live without these. I can't live without skincare. More than makeup, I can't live without skincare, which is why I like Elana products with their skincare more than, than makeup. Um, so I can't live without DBCC, I can't live without the setting sprays, I can't live without um, the foundations also, because they literally made my skin look nicer over time. So I literally can't live without Elana. LOL, Charot! <laughs> Elana face base, to be clear. I can't live without Elana face base. Question. Yes. Ilang minutes ka po nagkikilay? 
Me as a person, I don't wear kilay every day because I actually usually have bangs and I can cover my kilay. But when I do do kilay, um, I think we are alive with this. I usually take about two three minutes. This one is more shaped. This is more like kilay on fleek on uh, like sharper brows. This takes a little bit of a longer time because she's actually drawing new eyebrows on my face because I don't really have super eyebrows. Yeah. Hey, come on, Miss Grace. How many minutes can I get kilay? Fifteen minutes. Fifteen minutes. <laughs> What color is it? Light brown. This is light brown. That's yeah. the So what you're doing is you're actually putting. Are you putting concealer? Yeah. So you're actually. She's actually. If you guys are worried, the parang I, I get this question a lot. Di ko mahirap tanggalin ang ang life proof brow pomade. Paano nako nakamali ako? Concealer, friends. Concealer is your friend. Question from yes. Instagram. Paano magpa-service sa Elana stores? May minimum purchase ba? No ba? Pero dala kayo ba kung gusto mo matry si Elana? Okay. I know. Serve and a free make free makeup. Para makeup experience. Yeah. Yeah. There you go, Ram Carton. It's free. So you enjoy it. Because rarely, nagpapa. I swear, I haven't been wearing makeup in the past. I've just been wearing DGC primer. I haven't been wearing makeup in the past few weeks because I've been sick. This is the first time I'm wearing full face makeup in a while. It feels nice. I feel like a person like you. Question. Yeah. Turn off ba if makeup is overdue from your perspective as makeup guru? I'm not a makeup guru. <laughs> I'm not a makeup guru. I'll be really honest. I'm not an expert in makeup. I'm not a makeup artist. I'm just somebody who works for a makeup company and I'm more into skincare than makeup to be really honest. But in my opinion, makeup is really about your personal taste. And, you know, I wear makeup styles that not everybody likes. And I don't care because it's about my face and my rules. I wear this for myself. So I don't, in my opinion, I'm not even gonna really answer that because it doesn't really matter if you turn people off or not. It's my makeup. As long as you're appropriate. Like, malamang if you're going to a funeral, don't wear like rainbow face. I don't know, you know, it's gonna. Was appropriate to the occasion? You're fine. Do whatever you want. This one is really more a statement for Grace. Yes. Ang galing mo daw mag kila. Hi. Madalak yung sa landmark ang labang or inti si Grace. Dito. Make over, so this is the instant glass skin glow. So I want them to all see my face now. This is what my face looks like now. <laughs> Too close, <laughs> girl. This is my face now, and this is what it's gonna look like with glass skin glow. Let's do this! Oh, wait, now I'll cover my shirt. This is one fact that you're gonna know. With a glass skin glow, you need to cover if you have a white shirt. Not gonna lie. So go! Let's do this! Can you see? And you just... It's just a light tasting glow. You see, there's a little bit of a glow there. Right here. See now? Do they see the difference? One more question from Instagram. Yes. Can you sleep or nap while wearing the mineral I, foundation? I have napped wearing the foundation. Like, napping is fine. Two hours in lip is fine. But if you're gonna, at the end of the day, please wash your makeup. I've actually done like a, a, a test, an Alana test, where I, I took a nap for two hours and the makeup did not come off. It was still there. But if you're gonna go to sleep at night, please, please take off the makeup. Please, yeah. And that's it! Wow, I'm done! Okay, so this is what my makeup looks like. My eyebrows have not been this arched since 2000. <laughs> wow, I have not filled in my eyebrows in a while. This is, this is new for my face. <laughs> And services are free. That's what I look at, look like. Anybody else have any more questions before we end? Um, any more questions for me or for Miss Grace? Any more questions? Okay. Hi, questions. questions. Why yes. can't the lip drunk blush be used for the eyelids? Because the... Um, so I'm going to get really technical with you because you asked this. I'm going to get technical. So, um, the lip drunk blush ha uses um, pigment, obviously. Uh, makeup, color, cosmetics, lipstick, stuff like that. They use pigments to create the color. Some pigments are safe for your face, but not safe for the eyes because the skin on the eyes is thinner and so pigment can kind of saturate in and stain and you don't exactly want like permanently pink colored eyelids. So that's the thing with lip drop blush. It is safe for the lips, it's not gonna poison you. It's safe for the cheeks because the skin on the lips and the cheeks are quite thick, but your eyes, they have thinner skin. We don't want to stain the eyelids, so we don't use lip drunk blush on the eyelids. Also, lip drunk blush has fragrance. It has like a smell. Um, because it's a lip drunk blush, it's supposed to smell like cocktails. But you don't want fragrance in your eyeshadows. So, 
Okay, I guess last question. Last question before we end. Any more questions? Uh, what does Miss BC use to Miss Frankie's lips? That was the glass skin glow. Lip ah, lips. Sa lips, sa lips. lips. Which is paradise. It's my favorite color actually. It will come off. I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna be blunt. Lip drunk blush is not cancer proof on the lips. Paradise MTC MDs are not cancer proof on the lips, but they do stain your lips. So they, even if it's not like but thank god it's gonna still be there. It's just it's not like the matte lipstick where it's like forever the same color. You know what I mean? More natural. And we have a winner for the Facebook. Wait. Yeah. Facebook? Has it been, has the, has the device? Audience. Here you go. The winner is <coughs> Ona De La Cruz. Yeah! I don't have a drum, so I'm just like doing this. <laughs> Congratulations, Ona. Any more questions, guys? I think that's it. I'm We're okay. Good. Yeah. All right. So thank you guys so much. Please uh, do uh, make. Um, make it a part of your day, make it a part of your week to come over to the Alana booth and maybe get a little bit of a makeover. As you can see, they my eyebrows! They no, no purchase required. No purchase required. Just come over and try these experiences for yourself. We hope you guys enjoyed this live and we will see you on Thursday. We have another live on Thursday at 4 o'clock. It's just with me. It's with me again. I'm sorry. It's me again. Uh, where you guys can ask more questions. And yeah, I think that's it. Um, we're good. Enjoy. Have a great day. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye!